today we're back here um, in the same city world as you can see out in the distance we have the this building that we were working on yesterday um, but now it is fully finished on the inside well not fully but um it's basically finished so I figured out what this is and this is a actually gonna be a library so that's what it is I think it's kind of unique and cool to start with a library also I just think it has a unique look that would go with um, kind of a library and this is our next thing we're working on over here but I'll show you that in a minute but first I'll just show you the finished library so as you can see um, it has snowed a lot so we have the road here um, the way that I got the snow to not go on these sides is um, I actually put carpet over it see as you can see gray carpet over the gray concrete so um, it, the snow can't go there um, but oh, oops okay one thing I need to probably do is pave this road at some point um, make sure it's not all snowy because then you can't drive on it but I think the snow adds a really cool effect um, I added this uh, walkway in between what these two buildings are going to be um, so I'll just show you the interior real quick so this is going to be the town library I still need to put a sign out here um, but if we go inside you can see um, we've got some paintings here on the walls uh, there's an elevator right there but I'll show you that in a second there are just shelves and shelves of books and then out this way is you know just another exit probably emergency exit there's probably gonna be an alleyway here but just a nice way to get out quickly um, also just the fact that it's snowing a lot here just adds to the comfort of this you know cozy library um, and then on this side there's more and more books there's a balcony up there um, and then there's two little counters where you would check out your books with the librarian and actually I'm, I think I'm gonna add a librarian real quick let me grab um, where are the spawn eggs here I'll just um, look it up I just think that'll be a um, really cool touch there we go librarian and there's librarian you know checking out your books for you I'll just let them wander around um, and then over here we have some computers so it's a quiet place to work on stuff and then if we go upstairs, here we have um, a grand staircase, which isn't looking too grand. I might change it. I don't know. I just kind of built it on a, on a loom. Um, here we have a balcony down to the first floor. Um, also just some couches, some shelves with books. Um, that's pretty much the same on this side, except we have some computers for working on, you know, what do you need to work on in the library. And then the third floor is actually what's not finished, but this third floor is going to be a cafe and also you know like a little reading area so there's not gonna be any bookshelves on this floor just you know uh, there's a little cafe here and then I think I'm gonna fill up those chests and make it actually functional so if you were to play this in survival you know you could actually serve food and whatnot um, and then I'm gonna add some chairs and tables and everything we got the stairs and the elevator you know in case you can't take the elevator for some reason Maybe you're disabled or something. Um, we got like a nice jukebox over here. I'm gonna have a hangout area over here. It's gonna be awesome. I'm not gonna do that in this episode though. It's definitely something I would do off camera. But um, for now, let's go ahead and work on what we're gonna be working on today. So, oh, oh, one more thing I, I want to show you. So if you follow this um, alleyway right here, and you go all the way back, then you can actually see that. So first of all, there's just a snowy field back here. I might make a park or something. But up here, there's actually a ladder that goes up to the roof. So the roof's fully decorated as well. As you can see, here's the roof. Got a bunch of just AC units, stuff like that, supplying power to the library. And I just love the snow effect on it. I just think it looks great with snow on the rooftops. It's December, you know. It's just looking great. Um, but I'm very proud and happy of this library, the first building that I made in this world, uh, besides the houses. So, there it is. I think it looks nice. And then next door is the next thing I'm going to be working on. So, over here, I don't know if you can tell yet, but this building... Oh, whoops, I'm just trying to get rid of the snow. This building is actually going to be an auto garage slash auto repair store. So, as you can see, we have these big garage doors. Um, I'm going to have it where you can just pull your car in and get some repairs um, like that. So that is what this is, and that's what we're going to be working on today. So first things first, 
I need to grab some of the blocks that I'm going to be using. I'm probably going to have this go back to the other side. I'm just not sure where the other road is going to be yet, if it's going to be right behind here. or I'm thinking there's going to be another building back to back with the library, and then we're going to have a road like here. So I'm not going to do the back road just yet. Um, but I want to have big a big garage space with a bunch of just garagey stuff in here. That's my goal. So, first things first. Man, this snow is getting kind of annoying. I'm just going to build the wall around and see where we want the wall to go. This was kind of a rough thing of where the wall might have been going. But I can actually put it right up to this um, alleyway right here. So it just feels you know more compact, like kind of how a city is in real life. So, I really like this blue terracotta block, this light blue terracotta. It just looks really nice. Um, so, gonna just decorate this wall a bit. Let's see. Hmm. Okay, then actually I think I'm just gonna keep this layer of... Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep a layer of stone brick at the bottom. Um, so it looks like it has a foundation of some kind. I think that makes it look better. Here we go. But yeah, guys, I don't really know what, what sparked this kind of thing, but I just wanted to build an auto repair store. I feel like that's important um, for a city. You kind of need that. I gotta start making a list of all the different buildings we're gonna need in this city because I I want it to be eventually a fully functional like city where you know you have everything you need, places to work, places to live, uh, fun things to do, entertainment. I think one thing that I might build very soon is gonna be a movie theater. I think that's a great um, idea or a very like I don't know. I think that that'll be really fun to build. Just a big movie theater where people can go and enjoy movies in Minecraft. Um, and I saw I saw a video a long time ago of somebody who made a like working projector system kind of thing where you can actually kind of watch a movie. It was it was pretty cool. Um, I also want to have a normal theater, um, kind of like a you know like a Broadway kind of um, big stage theater for live theater. I think that'd be very cool. Um, so there we go on that. I think I'm just gonna. Keep this going around the top. I think I'm just going to do this too. I think it needs to be taller though. Um, so we can have, you know, a big feeling, like a big garagey feeling. Like I don't want the ceiling to just be here. I want the ceiling to be like really high. So... Hmm. Do I keep this out another block or nah? It's fine. It is fine. I can just put that there. And there we go. Um. Ooh, wait. Let me just look if this is gonna look good. Something like this. I'm just experimenting here, guys. I think that looks good. Looks great. I don't also I don't want to overuse the stone bricks, but I feel like they're just a, such a perfect block for building cities. Um, they just look like they kind of go with everything. That um just city look. Let's just keep this going. Um oh I want to I want to make sure that the front is gonna look all right. So here we got the front. Um I think I'm just gonna throw this wall back one block so that window's not cramped. Um, because it's not only going to be a garage, it's also going to be a store where you can buy, you know, tires or whatever you need. Things things for your car. All your car needs. Kind of like the one place you can go and get whatever you need for those things. I might as well just do what I did on the other side and extend it out another block. Like that. There's that, and then hmm. there's that. Looking nice. And this whole thing right here is gonna be a store, the store part, where you can buy things. This is the wall separating, obviously, the store from the garage. 
it's probably not going to be out of this, the same material, but um, just having that for now. I don't know yet if I might make a second floor on this part and just make a little apartment um, for you know the owner of the shop to live or something like that. I think that might be cool. Oh, another thing I wanted to build that I was brainstorming about is a shooting range. But as you know, there's no guns in Minecraft, so like a shooting range for your bow and arrow. Because they released um, target blocks, which are actually really, really cool looking. And they make it where... Um, oh, I'm just going to keep that. They make it where you can, you know, it looks exactly like a target. Which is awesome. I'm just going to experiment here with some different designs. Yeah, why not? Um, let's 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 grab some quartz. I was originally gonna make this out of quartz and not the blue block, but you know, it's all about experimentation, figuring out what's gonna look good. Hmm. Let's just see what that's gonna look like. Yeah, I think that looks alright, right? right? Let's do it. Let's do a mix of that and then the blue. So, first, I want to keep this blue sh um, like streak going up. The one, two, three, with the bricks on either side. Something like that, and then I'm actually gonna put the white on after I do the what I want to keep carrying up. Um. I want. I definitely want to have kind of a uh, like a so a room for a big sign. Like I don't know for the name of this place, like Tony's or something like that, or like Auto Repair or something. I think I'm gonna do that above this part. So I'm just gonna leave this um, blank for now with just this blue block. I might change it later. Not really sure. But that's the beauty of Minecraft. You can just delete it when you when you don't want when you want to change it makes things super easy okay yep that's definitely where the sign is gonna be let me carry this up and I'll just carry this around why not you know I'm also just going to try something real quick and see if I like it. I'm just throwing iron bars on here. I wonder how that would look. I like that look. Makes it look like, you know, it's in kind of the rough part of the city. You know, you need some iron bars for protection. <laughs> Not really, but, you know. That's the kind of city I'm going for here. Kind of like a, you know, a bustling. There's probably some crime. Bustling city. A lot of stuff all compact together, but not necessarily like an overcrowded city, but just, you know, a busy city. Not like New York City, where, you know, all the buildings are touching and it, everyone's so close together. But I also want it to feel like a condensed um, body of people living together. So I am going to turn off the snow because that's getting kind of annoying at this point, just covering everything up. Um, so here's the boom it's looking better already not sure that I want to keep these stairs though so let's just let's see how it looks if I don't have those what if I just put windows there instead that's an idea Yeah, that doesn't look too bad. Ooh, and I could also put, like, um... I'm just gonna see how this looks for now. But I could put, like, a window on here. Just so it would let in light during the day. And I wouldn't have to, you know, put lights everywhere. Just to see how it looks. Let's see. It's all about trial and error. I like it. Let's keep it. 
Why not? See, because, I mean, you can try things. It might look good, it might look bad, but um, at the end of the day, you tried it, and uh, you can use it in a future build if you keep the idea. Yep, that doesn't look bad. Mm, wait, do I want to do Omar block up, though? Let's see. Yeah, I do. I want this to be five blocks for the sign. So, that's an easy fix. I'll just move it up a little bit. And uh, we can have a ton of space for a nice looking sign, which I want to work on in this episode. I just don't know what it's going to be called yet. Not sure. I should have thought of that ahead of time. But, of course I didn't. So, we got to figure it out. I'm thinking, like, just auto repair or some something. I, I want it to be obvious this is like a auto repair store. I mean, the garage doors kind of give it away, but, you know, I want it to be kind of obvious. I think, hmm, and, and I also need to figure out how much space for letters that I have, too. But yeah, the, um, in any other pretty much city that I've built, um, the magic rule for building signs is kind of you want to have a five block thing, because usually the letters are going to be three blocks tall, and you want to block under and above, just for, um, room. Trust me, it's a good, it's a good, um, good rule to go by, um, and it gives you enough space. So that's not looking too bad. I don't know if I like it that much though, but you know, it's not looking bad. It's not looking bad at all. I don't. Do I want to continue this around? Hmm. Maybe. We will see. Gotta build up the wall first, though. It's the first step, for sure. Here we go. Also, y'all, please like um, feel free to leave any kind of suggestions in the comments. Um, I will definitely be looking at all of them. Seeing as you know, it's not a big, very big channel. I'm just doing this for fun. Um, so, I'd love to hear what the subscribers and other people have to say. Um, any suggestions that they have. Yep. This is looking snazzy. I'll do the same on the other side. Hmm. Wait, why is this... Oh, I guess I didn't mean to do this. There we go. Boom, boom. I guess I really do, I really like the light at the top, but I just don't know about the um, windows in the middle. Like, I like the top part a lot, but I just don't know about this middle part. Let me just try one more thing. Just see, what does it look like if I just fill it in? Let's just see. Don't get too too, too worried. Just gonna take a look. Um, <laughs> that looks not very good. Okay, what if I did this then and filled this in? What would that look like? That looks better actually. I like that. I think I'm gonna keep it like that. Boom. Alrighty, so, um, ooh, that'd be cool if there were some way to get up here and you could look across at, in the windows of the library and talk to the person across the way, <laughs> kind of like you can in a real city. Um, okay. Okay. So, that's what we got so far. Um, let me go fill in the back part and then we can start working on the interior. Um, let me see what time we're at. We're already at 16 minutes. Wow. Um, time flies, for sure, when you're building. For sure. This isn't too long, is it? Nah, this is a good-sized building. It's it's big, but, um, you know, going to have a lot of room for cars and whatnot. I might have, um, what I did in one of my other worlds is I, in the lobby of uh, the auto store, I had 
one of those cars for you know for display. I might put a big window down there um, that you can buy, kind of like the car that they show on uh, Family Feud. That if you win, you get the uh, the big car. I really like that idea. Hmm. If I was going to, I would put it like right here. Let's just see how that looks. Like it would be, whoops. It would be like over here on a display. I actually think I'm gonna do that because I liked I liked doing it in my other world, uh, so I think it would look cool here. Um. Yep, that'd be really cool. Okay. Next things next. The back of the building. Very important. I always try to, um, when I make buildings, I always try to make the back somewhat similar to the front, but um, never identical. Like um, how I did it with the library over here. The front is like a, a circular thing. This kind of is, but it's only protruding out one block, so it's like way flatter. So it's the same kind of concept, but it looks different, which I think is very important with the back of builds. Uh, because, you know, you don't want it to look super, um, like you just copy and paste. Kind of like you use World Edit and just copy and paste the front to the back, which is no fun, you know, you need variety. Um, another building that I'm going to be building soon is a barbershop and also a restaurant. So I got a little list of things to build in the near future. Um, and as always, any suggestions are greatly, greatly appreciated all the time, you know? So here we go. I think for the main next few videos, I'm going to be just kind of working on exteriors, kind of filling up this plot of the city. And then um, as we get further on, I could either do the interiors off camera or I could do them on camera. So whatever you guys want to see. see everybody there is the finished exterior for the auto parts store um, so wow already made some progress on this world um, only two episodes but yeah guys thank you so much for watching this video um, be sure to leave a like if you did enjoy this one um, also leave a comment for sure um, any suggestions um, or just you know whatever you want to see on the world um, without further ado thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one later